Hello. In this brief video, I will demonstrate some NWA proctor training, which will include your first logon and how to create your testing session. To log on to the NWA map as a proctor, you will have to first locate the email that was sent by the map autoresponder at NWEA. The subject is NWEA map profile has been updated. If you do not have this email, please contact me and I will make sure to update your information. In this email, you will have your username, which is your stand.org email address, and there will also be a temporary password. You'll be asked to change this password when you log in. There's also a link, and that's where you will uh, log in. So let's start by logging in. When you log in for the first time, it'll ask you to change to a new password. Once you're logged in, you will be on this page. You can tell that you're logged in because you will have your login in the upper right-hand corner. On the left-hand corner in this blue is the control panel. So to manage a test session, you would select Manage Test Sessions. Once you are there, you select Test My Class. From Test My Class, you need to select all your students and then you need to assign tests. There's a variety of tests and each class will be different. Since this is a grade 6 class we are going to do grade 6 plus common core and then you select the assign button. Once assigned you will see the test assignment appears in this block over here for each of the students. Once the, the test is assigned you will have your students open up their lockdown browser and they will have to enter in the test session name as well as the password. When the students complete entering their test session name and their password, they will be asked to select their name from a list. As they select their name from the list, you will be alerted in this control panel, under here what will say to be confirmed. As more of them enter their, select their name, the more numbers. You will periodically click this confirm now button during that time which will allow them to begin the test. And you will see in testing with the numbers. Now this center column will show you what number they are on as they are testing. After the test is complete, you will select end testing session. Once the testing is complete you will need to name the test session. Naming the test session will be done right here and the convent naming convention that we want to use is the teacher's last name, so it will be your last name, the month, dot, the year, and then followed with a letter M for math, R for reading, or S for science. For this one, we are going to just put an M. And then when you are finished, you would hit Save and Exit. When you see this screen, you have completed the testing session. I want to thank you very much for watching this video. Goodbye.